ISU's football opener is Saturday night against Butler. This summer, the Redbirds worked towards improving on the field and stronger relationships off it. It's been nearly two years since the ISU Redbirds played a fall football game at home. They're glad to be back in their element at Hancock Stadium, playing football, being together, which was challenging in the winter and spring. I think all the separation, we couldn't meet as a team, that kind of drove us apart, but a big uh, goal for us this summer was just have a lot of team activities, you know, get to know each other, build relationships. Team bonding has been a major emphasis for the Redbirds since the premature end of their injury-riddled spring season. Showing togetherness on the field is one thing, the players want to make sure that carried off the field as well. We did many things outside of just football. You know, guys went on paintball trips together, you know, just doing things outside, having water gun fights in the neighborhoods, in our neighborhood. Like, we just did things to make sure that we all had that, com that camaraderie and, you know, just being together and laughing and just being, being teammates. Even though he's been at this a long time, Brock's back admits he's learned a lot about football and players and relationships in the last year and a half. And he determined the best way to coach this year's team is to let the players do a lot of the coaching themselves. In July, we went back to the old way. I, I told the staff, you guys go on vacation, you take your family out of here, and I let the players run it. And, and they love that. They are bonding and holding one another accountable. Saturday, they hope to see winning results on the field.